Whooped it. Bitch, I'm outside of some movie. Blue cheese. I swear I'm addicted to blue cheese. I gotta stick to this paper like blue sleep. Bitch, I'm by my chicken like it's a two piece. You can have your bitch back. She a groupie. She just swallow all my kids in a two seat. Swagged out. Familiar, we bringing them gas out. I still got some racks stuffed in the truck. Baby, I need to know you. video so i know this is kind of late and y'all are probably thinking sapphire is damn near about to be april yes you guys are completely right about this but i've been meaning to do this video for a minute now because i have been collecting so many different coats for over the years lots of different textures prints colors as you guys can see and this is just not all of it this is just what's on this rack you still have to go through the coats that are in the closet but i don't want to make this intro too too long so i want to hop straight into it but before we begin i want to change into something a little bit more easier to put the coat on so let's change into like a tank top much better so i don't want to take too much time explaining each coat the look of it explains itself but we're gonna start this way and then we're gonna go to what's in my closet this video might be a minute but i'm, I'm gonna try to make this quick so the first coat we're gonna start with is my brown fur forever 21 coat this coat i got about i want to say a couple years ago i definitely got it during black friday i don't know why but i always get my coats from forever 21 on black friday because forever 21 does the same deal every year it's always 50 percent off and most of these fur coats that you see well yeah three out of like the five i have are from forever 21. forever 21 has pretty decent quality fur coats obviously it's fake fur this is not real fur i don't remember the prices if i remember the prices i will let y'all know but this coat was originally like i want to say 40 ish dollars and i probably got it for like 20 with the discount but she's cute she has a button it's cut here it's cropped i love a cute crop coat i'm not super big on long coats but i want to start getting into longer coats because i find myself needing long coats a lot recently and i just don't have any also if you guys were wondering this rack is from amazon if you guys want it i think it saves a lot of space if you especially if you have a lot of winter clothes so i definitely do recommend it but this jacket or vest vests are included in this haul by the way or this collection video this vest is also from forever 21 you know what's crazy i think i only worn this vest like only once out you guys know that i love red i have about four red coats which is probably more than the average person would have red but i don't know it's just something about red i just love how it pops this vest is super cute it's not cropped i think maybe that's why i don't wear it i don't know i think it's cute i definitely do want to wear her more it has a hood that i can't really keep on because my hair is so big but she's cute she's a vibe but i just don't see myself picking her up as much and this coat was also this vest was around like 50 ish dollars too this is like probably one of my favorite purchases this coat i seen bad nana had this is a youtuber that i watch she's really really good i love her vlogs and her haul videos definitely her haul videos and she ooh, she's dirty she needs to get clean but she had a coat like this i think she also got this from fashion nova that's where i got this one i got the same exact coat i think this coat is definitely at least 50 dollars. i don't know if it's 50 or 60 it's just a denim jacket it has gray fur in it to keep you warm this is actually you would think this doesn't keep you warm because it's a denim jacket and it's thin but surprisingly this has definitely kept me warm during the winter days i got this in a size small and it's still very oversized the white fur on the sleeves and then the white fur on the collar silver detailing you can take the fur off it has like little buttons that you can take off but like that takes too much time and i feel like the white fur is what makes the coat so i usually don't take it off but i think it's super cute if you have like a very casual plain outfit on i would definitely pop this coat on just now realizing how many coats i have and how many i have to go through pink fur coat this pink fur coat is also from forever 21 very cute one thing about me if i like it i will buy it in every color i just wanted like a pop of color that wasn't red and i was going through my phase of pink like i was buying everything pink still kind of am but pink is low-key becoming like my second favorite color like it's red pink and then like you know black and white all the basic colors but 
this coat is super cute crop the same concept this coat i just bought from windsor literally like i want to say a couple weeks ago this is a plaid cropped jacket blazer type esque it's very formal it fits okay this is a large if your arms are any bigger than mine then you will not be able to move at all like this is this is as much as i could do like the arms are very small low-key feel a little claustrophobic but listen, i would this is the type of coat i would like take a picture in and call it a day it does come with the skirt if you do like the sets like that i like the, the skirt but i'm not i wasn't like dying i wasn't like oh my god i need the skirt but the jacket i was like yeah i need this jacket and this is really different i don't have anything like this in my closet so i was like let me pick this up this jacket retails for about 54 dollars if i'm not mistaken now this is my famous money coat this money coat also Banana had this coat on. Banana has given me a lot of inspiration when it comes to like coats and stuff because she's into coats just as much as I am. So she had this coat in one of her sheeting hauls and I was like, ooh, this is fire, especially with the money purse. You remember when that money purse shit was trending? I still have mine, but I haven't I worn it like once and that's it. And I think it was with this coat. But this coat is really cute, it's puffy, it's keeping its shape. I had this coat for I got this coat freshman year of college been about two years i mean i only worn her i think like twice but like she's still cute and i gotta take her out one day like one of these days i need to pop her out because it's been a minute this is like my only like really long coat i have a couple more not really i think i only have one two more long coats but this oh my god look what i found a pair of gloves i'm always finding something in these coats but this brown coat is from windsor also this coat was actually on sale i think it was originally it's definitely at least fifty dollars, but it was on sale for like seven, which is crazy. Like, when you be having like these full blown out coats and shit on sale, but this is a fur coat that's on the thinner side. You guys can't really see how long it goes. This is definitely like my go-to coat because it's a longer coat and it's brown, so it goes with a lot of things. Sixteen coverages. Now I'm so surprised this coat still fits me because I literally got this coat in like high school, like young like i was probably like 16 15 when i had this coat girl was about to be 21 i don't know how this coat still fits me but it's comfortable like it's loose it's a little bomber jacket this green color i think this coat is from pink i don't really wear pink clothes that often anymore i was really into pink growing up but like now i just kind of died out of it unless it's like gym clothes i love their workout sets i love love, love their workout sets but this car i think i kept because of the color the material like it's like a satin and it has a hood that's like cotton if you guys can see the detailing and like again the color i don't have any green coat like this so i don't think i'll ever give this away just because of the color but she's fire and she got pockets and she's thick, double line, that's what I'm talking about. We love a good white fur. We sure if I can do this white fur is, oh my God. Another, I, these are the tan gloves I was originally looking for and I bought those, the ones I just took out of the brown coat because I lost these, but I just found them. You know what? Two pairs of gloves. Who would have thought this would have been the haul where I would find all my fucking gloves? But anyway, this white coat is from Fashion Nova. I recently just got this one because my other white coat was just dirty i washed her as much as i could and the stains were just not coming out honestly this one's about to expire too because the first thing that always gets dirty in all my coats is the collar the collar is always the first thing to go she's gonna she's gonna have to retire like next winter i'm gonna have to buy a new white fur coat but this is really cute she's not cropped she's like pretty full size and this one does have a zipper my other fur coats do not have a zipper this is giving more like jacket than fur coat but since it's fur it just gives more of like a bougie vibe but I don't usually zip it up unless it's like really cold. Now this red coat is also from Forever 21. It has the button. It's the same. It's still the same kind of style, but it's a little bit different because this one's way longer than the other ones. Like it, like it's pretty full cover. You guys can't really see, but it goes all the way down. This is definitely one to keep you a little bit more warmer than the other ones. Honestly, I wasn't even gonna get this length. I wanted to get the crop one, just like the pink and what color did I have? Pink and round. But they didn't have my size, so I was like, you know what? I'm not passing up on this red fur coat. So I'm just going to get this size. And I mean, there's nothing wrong with that. I probably won't have it buttoned like that. You can have it like this. That looks a little bit better, but I still like, you know, the open look. I'm just now realizing how many coats I actually have from Forever 21. Like, who would have thought that majority of my coat collection is from Forever 21? This is also from Forever 21, this leather 
jacket. I had this jacket for a long time too, and I'm surprised I did not grow out of it. It's getting there. I wouldn't say it's an amazing quality leather jacket, but honestly, it gets the job done. Like, I can't complain, and I don't really wear this jacket out. Like, last time I wore this jacket was for Halloween when I was Tiffany from Ryder Chucky's, so that was the first time I worn it in like at least a year or two. So, she doesn't really come out, but like, when she needs to. You know, certain looks you have to wear a leather jacket. Like sometimes I don't want to go the fancy route. Sometimes I want to be a little bit more grungy. So I'll put the motorcycle jacket on. Now my bandana jackets. I don't know what I was going through. No, I'm just kidding. But these jackets are actually really cute, but I don't wear them. I've worn this once. And the one I'm about to show you in a minute. Actually, I'm going to show you the white coat. And then I'll show you the bandana, but the pink one. But this, I don't really wear this much. I got this in a size medium. I wish I got a small because she's a little... She's a little big. I, I need to get rid of some of these coats. I really do because I'm just going to keep buying coats and keep buying coats. And it's just going to stop. And I just need to start going. This honestly should be like a the closet clean out of coats. Like I should make that series of going through each individual type of item and cleaning it out. But that'd be a good series, y'all. Let me know if y'all would like to see that. So I feel like I should start doing that. Like go through like my dresses, my shoes, my jeans. Even though I've been doing like a jean clean out so i think i'm good on jeans but i don't know let me know if y'all would like to see that but this coat she's cute nothing really talk about you have to have a specific outfit on for this like you can just like go out and wear this coat is so nasty like i like the collar is yellow like that's how bad and i just bought this coat it hasn't even been a year yet and this coat is already dirty this coat is also from forever 21 i bought this black friday of last year and this shit is already dirty. Isn't that fucking crazy, y'all? Same type of material, just like pink one. Pink one was actually cuter than the white one. And I remember I bought this coat because I have a pair of Air Max 97s that are this color. And I was like, oh my God, that's so fucking cute. But I think I've worn those sneakers maybe three times. And this coat, that one time I took a picture that's no longer on my Instagram. But she's still cute, size medium. It's a little big, like I don't know why. I always think I'm bigger than what I am, and I'm like, oh, a medium, but like, girl, like, this is huge. Like, you could have got away with a small. It's okay, it's cute. There's this purpose, and will I wear it again? Maybe. I always say, like, you know what, Sapphire, you need to start wearing your pieces you haven't worn in years, and that never happens. It never does. I think we're out of Forever 21 coat territory for now, but this coat is from Express. This actually is a coat that my mom had, and she passed it on to me because I ruined my black coat somehow. And I don't know what happened, but I, I threw away my black coat and she was like, you know what, you can take this one because I don't wear it that much. I was like, don't mind if I do. This is a very, very good quality. Like you could tell this is from Express. Like this shit, like Forever 21 is cute, but you could tell like this is like real good fur. Like this is from Express. And I don't own anything else from Express because I don't know, I just always thought that was more of like a grown, I was given more grown woman, like I am a grown woman, but when I got this coat, I wasn't really a grown woman. So maybe I should check out what's in there. But it always gave like business-y, you know, woman to me. So that's why I never really went in there. No, this coat is like a vibe. Like this is, this is a very cute coat. It fits nice. The same Texas. Woo! Down, 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 down. Mm -mm 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 oh this jacket also from windsor it's super cute i haven't worn her yet i mean i haven't had the opportunity to wear her i mean beyonce just announced at to cowboy carter so if she ever goes on tour and i can afford to go on tour because <sighs> not to take is very expensive i already seen her in rent for her renaissance tour but this jacket is still very cute it was actually on sale i still have the tag on it still have not worn her yet it was originally 49.90 and i got it for like seven dollars this just gives like sexy secretary or some shit like that i don't know but this gives every time i wear this coat people say like oh it's giving matrix like i could see that i could see matrix but like i don't know i feel like i take offense to that because matrix like who am i am i am i giving tiffany y'all is that her name that's definitely not her name what the fuck is her name oh my god i literally just seen the matrix not too trinity there we go there we go am i giving trinity <laughs> am i giving trinity <laughs> but this is a super cute coat if i didn't mention this is awesome from windsor you know windsor just takes over my whole closet she's very cute you guys can't really tell how long it is because my bed is blocking the way but it's really cute it has a tie it cuts here i love this part how it layers like that's really 
it's really sexy to me, but it's a good coat. This next coat is a bomber jacket. I said we were done with Forever 21 for a minute, but she came right back. This bomber jacket I literally just got and I took a picture in it. It was so freaking cute. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram, what are y'all doing? But this coat is a New York jacket because y'all know I'm from New York, so I had to represent. This is East Coast on here. The back, I think, is plain. I think, I don't know. I don't know, but hey. It's a really cute, like, varsity jacket. I don't really have that many. I have one other varsity jacket. I should also make this disclaimer. I am not including jean jackets. I have, like, I have two denim blue jean jackets. I have a white denim jacket, and I have a black denim jacket. And I think that's it for denim jackets. But I'm not including those because that's, like, more, like, you know, jackets. This is more coats. Even though you might not consider this to be a coat. And the I have some coats at home that I just don't have here. And I have some under my bed. I'm not getting that. I'm just going to show y'all what's on this rack and in my closet. Now, this is giving coat to me. Like, this is giving, like, oh, you're trying to be warm. This is what this coat is giving. This coat is from Zara. I was able to snag this for a very good price on Black Friday. Like, I paid under $30 for this. Actually, no, I think the coat was, it was either 30 or $20, but this is really good for a Zara coat. You know Zara be taxing. It's ridiculous, but it's really cute. I bought this coat because I don't have, like, a tan color coat, like a big coat, so I was like, there we go, $30. It's cute. It gives you some shape when you zip it up. Hold on, hold on. It's giving me some shape. Is it or isn't it? I got this in a size small. If you want a little bit more room, I would go size up, but you probably can't find this coat anymore because this was about like two years ago, but she's cute. Ooh, she has the hood. It's giving, it's definitely giving, you can close it. Like this is a real deal coat. Like all the other little coats, you wear it to look cute. This one is gonna keep you warm, definitely. Even though it looks thin, it's real good quality, I promise. Oh, I'm lying, this coat is an extra large. It says USA XL. This coat is not giving extra large. This is how you know, like companies, like I don't know what it is. The more expensive shit is, the smaller it is because there's no way this is the extra large. See, I thought this coat was from Forever 21, but it's actually from Pretty Little Things. This is a cute red coat. This is like the first red coat I bought for myself. It's super, super cute. It's just a cute little cropped jacket bomber. Like, it's really freaking cute. I have the elastic thing here. I don't know if you guys can see from all the way over there, but you could do that if you want to tighten the waist part, but I don't know. I don't really, I don't really like that, like, because then it get tight and it'd be moving all over the place. I don't like that. I like it to just sit here, so, you know. It's a cute jacket, though. I really like it. This is probably one of my favorite jackets, honestly. Like, this jacket is fucking fire. My mom gave me this jacket. She, this was, like, her jacket in, like, high school and shit, but, oh, why do I have pockets? It didn't have pockets? That's crazy, but it's just, like, a Ralph Lauren polo jacket. Like, y'all, this is fucking insane. Like, look at the detailing. I wore this coat once for a picture, and, like, it didn't get the recognition it deserved because this coat is ridiculous of how fire this shit is. Like, look at this. I love this coat. It's so beautiful, and it's it's good fucking quality. Good fucking quality, and it's white. It's like a cream color. And we have the infinite red trench coat. I just worn this coat for the first time this Christmas with my boyfriend. It was so cute. I definitely feel like I could have did a better outfit, but you know what? I'm okay. I'm okay with this outfit. I'm okay with the outfit I wore, but it's just a regular red fur coat. This coat is from Finesse. If you guys know that brand, they have really cute stuff on there. But it has a whole belt situation. Let me see if I could buckle it. Like a belt. Like this is really cute. I will say that it runs really big. This is a size small. And it definitely is big. I could have did an extra small for it so it could fit a little bit smaller. But most of the time, like, I had it open anyway. So if you have it open, it doesn't look that ridiculous on you. Why is it getting tighter? I'm trying to get out of it. I'm getting more into coats that are already in my closet. So this black coat is from Shein. This is like, it used to be my go-to black coat until I bought this other coat that I will show you guys in a minute. But this is just a cute little black puffer jacket. It has a zipper, no pockets. Shein jackets never have pockets. 
that's just the reality but it's okay a cheap little jacket nothing too crazy as a collar and yeah it served it gets the job done i was wearing it literally before i filmed this video but this is the same as the black one but i don't know this one feels more puffier to me like i don't know if i got this in a bigger size maybe that's what it is but this one seems a little bit more puffier to me but i still like this one this one's really cute and i had all oh, i had these sheen coats for a good amount of time this is my go-to black coat this coat is from windsor i had this coat for a little over a year now and i have worn her into the ground like i literally have worn this coat i wear this coat almost every day whenever i'm wearing something black or something that i need a black coat i'm gonna put this on this coat is still really good there is a crop version of this coat but i don't want to buy the crop version i really want to rebuy this coat but we haven't gotten it so i don't even know if they make this coat anymore this vest is so tiny and i can't tell if it's like tiny cute or it looks like bitch this shit is too small for you like let me know in the comments below if y'all think this is too small for me or if I'm able to get away with it. It's a regular white vest. I didn't have a white vest, so I was like, let me just pick it up. This is also Fushi and really cute. It's not meant to really zip up because then you're gonna look like this and that looks dumb. The open, it's cute, it's cute and stylish. This black puffer vest is from Windsor. This one's really cute. I don't get enough wear out of her. I definitely worn her a couple times. Like, it's not like I abandoned her, but like, you know. I feel like if it was a little, it's a, it's a smidge bit shorter. I think I will wear her more, but this is still a very good quality jacket. And of course, like I said before, if I like it in one color, I'm gonna get in another color. So this coat, I mean, well, this vest, I like this brown. It's not like a typical dark brown. It's giving, it's giving very much chestnut. Like this can go with my Uggs. Like that'd be very cute. But this is a very cute brown vest. Oh my god, I have so many. I have one more vest. One more vest to show y'all. This is another vest I have, my last one. This is also from Windsor. The cool thing about this one is you can wear it on the black side. You can wear it on like this brown side. I don't even know what, what color. Like it's brown, but like it's a weird brown. Like that's why I don't really wear this one or this side as much. But she's still a really cute coat and I like how, how it's reversible. Okay, this leather jacket. Oh god, it's so tight. This leather jacket is, I don't even know if I would consider this a jacket. It's giving more shirt because you cannot move it in this bitch. I got it in a size medium, I think, because that in the reviews to go up a size. Ooh, I'm getting lightheaded. All this trying on shit. But, you yeah, know, this jacket is too tight. I honestly might give this one away. Because I'm like, when am I going to wear this again? I took my picture. I had my moment. And that's it. Three more coats to go through. Now this one is kind of giving jacket too. It's very thin, but like I just love the concept of it, of like a shiny, plasticky looking material. This is awesome for Shein. I had this coat for about a minute. It's super cute. I haven't worn her in a minute because when I first bought it, I did wear it a lot. So kind of got tired of it, but she'll come out eventually. When I'm just going somewhere casually, like she'll come out. I think it's a really cute coat. Now this coat is definitely giving more bomber jacket. Is this another pair of gloves? Oh my god, so this coat I think is from Against All Odds, if you guys know what that is, but it's really cute, it's just this red bomber jacket, again it's red, and it has all these patches, American the flag, the eagle, and the air force, that's what it's giving, um, the back, it's just really cute, it's just a really cute standard typical bomber jacket, and it's orange, that's cool. For my last coat is this brown leather jacket. I don't even know where this is from. I want to say American Eagle, but I think I'm off with that one. But this is a really cute brown leather jacket. Again, I kept it because it's brown and it's leather. Like, I'm just like, certain certain clothes I can't give away because you can't always find a brown leather jacket. Like, I could always find a white coat and I could always find a fur. But leather jackets is kind of iffy, and especially because they are on the more pricier side. So I try to keep certain things and certain colors that I know I can't find that much of. So that's why I kept this chocolate brown. Like, this is a very sexy coat. And I really like it. It's snug. I mean, it's not going to keep you that warm. But it's like one of those, like, stretchy leathers where, like, you can move. Like, I can move in this one. That black one, I cannot move in that one. But this is a very cute coat. And I love it. Oh, well, guys, that's pretty much it for today's video. It is hot. And I am just over talking about coats and trying all them on because it is hot in here i'm about to turn my fan on thank you guys so much for watching today's video if you liked today's video make sure to like comment and subscribe hit that bell to be notified when i post new videos i would love you guys and i'll see you guys in the next week's video bye guys